following segment is sponsored by America First Credit Union. It's not too late to help feed hungry kids here in Utah. Nicole with America First Credit Union is here to tell us how we can donate. Welcome, Nicole. Thanks for joining us. Thank you. Good to be here. Absolutely. We're so excited to have you. So first off, why does America First Credit Union sponsor the Super Bowl of Caring? So it's just a natural fit for us. Uh, the credit union has been involved in giving back to the community for a number of years, especially with the Utah Food Bank. I think our partnership goes back to 1998 is when we initially started working with them. So when this opportunity came around, it was a natural fit for us to be able to jump in and help uh, collect donations to help feed hungry kids in Utah. Absolutely. Tell me a little bit about what the Super Bowl of Caring represents. So. This is an opportunity for all of us that um, have Super Bowl parties and celebrate that day for us to maybe think about all the food that we have in abundance on that day mm -hmm. and what can we maybe do without and give to this um, cause to help feed kids. Um, when you think about, I'm a mom, mm -hmm. I have four boys, and when I think about that there's kids that go home from school um, that they don't have food in their homes, um, that's heartbreaking. And so again, if there's a way that we can contribute and give back and help those kids, um, it's something that we should take advantage of and help do. I love the concept because as you said, you know, this time of year with the Super Bowl parties, a lot of times there's an abundance of food and it's a good reminder to give back to those who are food insecure. Um, tell me where the proceeds go. So uh, the proceeds, we made a donation this morning. The proceeds go to the Utah Food Bank, as well as I know there's some school districts that also benefit from it. Um, there's pantries in schools, they have food trucks that go around. So all of the money is going towards food and helping feed hungry kids. Amazing, Nicole. Tell me, when is the last day that donations can be accepted? So you have a couple of more days to be able to donate. Um, it's through February 11th. Um, and again, that we'll get all those donations collected and get them sent off to those um, organizations that help support those kids. And for people who just are wanting to give back, can they donate in addition to money? Can they donate food as well? They can. So you can donate online and donate money. Um, uh, there's a link on your website, and I believe there's a link on our website. Um, and then you can also donate food to the Utah Food Bank. Tell me a little bit about what America First Credit Union does as far as in the community. I know that you guys are so actively involved and you do a lot. We do. We look for opportunities. I, I mentioned we do a food drive every year. Um, we have a program called Warm the Souls where we buy uh, shoes for school-aged children. Uh, we have a, a, a program internally called Greater Good where we encourage our employees to find a program that they're passionate about in the community and give back, whether that's donating hours, time, or money. Uh, but we really want people to get involved and give back to the community. I love that. So many different opportunities to give back. And tell me really quick, what services does America First Credit Union provide? We are a full-service financial institution. So if it's you're just looking for a savings account, out. We can help you checking, a mortgage loan, visa card, um, investments. There's all kinds of products and services, but we really focus on technology. We've got great services to protect you. Card guard, if you're not aware of that, that's amazing. But come in and see us. We'd love to help you. All right, Nicole, it's such a pleasure. Thank you as always for coming in. And if you guys want to text to donate, text the number on your screen.